This is the video by Rich Ben. Today we're working on a Saturn S series. And what we're going to be doing today is removing the door lock cylinder right here. Now, the first thing we need to do is to remove the outside door handle. Now, lift up on the handle, put something like a screwdriver. In my case, I'm using a wooden dowel underneath the little arm there. Now, uh, the handle is held on by a little plastic pin right here. You can use a screwdriver, or in my case, I made a special tool that grabs both sides of the head so it doesn't deform it. Right underneath the head there, you want to just get there, lift it back, just like that. Now you can remove the little push pin. Once that's out of the way, you can take the handle, now push it this way, and it'll come right off. And there it is. Now we can remove our retainer here. Now after we remove the outside door handle, we want to remove the side mirror here. I have a video on this to, to remove it if you need it. There isn't much to, to see, just a bunch of 10 millimeter nuts that hold it to the door and once you remove those you can remove the mirror now the next thing we need to do is to take the outside door skin off it's held on by these T30 headed screws now if you t have to take them off for the first time they put a Loctite on them and they are difficult to get off. They're a shouldered screw. And that's what they look like. And we need to take all those off now. Now after you get those T30 bolts out of the way, you'll find a T15 bolt right here. Actually, it's a screw, it's very small. And we need to remove that. There it is. Now, the only thing that is holding the outside skin on now is this strip right here on the top. So to remove that, we're going to use a stiff putty knife and we're going to get just underneath the lip. We're not going to go in too far. Just underneath that lip. I'm going to work from this far side first over to this side. And I'm going to use my finger to hold up the end as I go. I think you can see it from there. Now put your knee against the panel because once that's off, that panel might want to come off. If you go in too deep, you can do some damage to the skin. Okay, there it is. It's all off. Okay, now that we got that off, I'll grab it down here on the bottom, and there it is. Now we can peel back the weather deflector here to gain access to our lock cylinder. Okay. Uh, we can see it. Okay, now we can see the clip right here that holds the lock cylinder into position. Now all we need is an ordinary pair of pliers. Grab it by this little tang right here on the clip and work it up and out like so. Now once we get that clip out of the way, we can go in on the cylinder bring it down now work it to the 
front a little bit, right over here. Now, once you get it into this position, like so, let me move this camera down here. Now, now that we got it in this position, we can just wiggle it off the arm. And there it is. The door locks on and it's all out. And that's it for removing your door lock cylinder on your Saturn S series.